It's very a testimony by a witness who was, I think, 16 years old at the time. She said she related that when they got to camp, that they were for, required to strip down naked, and that some I don't somebody doctor, some health official, if indeed he was, conducted a vi vaginal examination of all the girls, and she said I was one of them. Now in the, in this age today where things are kind of free and loose, they say, people may shrug their shoulders, okay, so what? But by the standards of 1942, and particularly by the standards of the Nikkei community, notwithstanding the fact that uh, presumably Nikkei engaged in co-ed bath, going bathing co-ed at night in the Ofuro, I was very aware of the sensitivity of uh, not exposing your body. And that when this girl testified about having a vaginal examination made, to me it was a very serious encroachment, very grave encroachment. And that stuck with me. And I thought to myself, why did you even dare examine these people? I mean, these people didn't come off some, le some leper colony. These were ordinary Americans living in a community like anybody else, and you happen to bring them in together, and you're now conducting a vaginal examination. How dare you? How dare you? And that stuck very much in my mind. 